Okay, so I guess just for some context, um, what I find doing some, some of the user research work is there's a lot of cool conversations happening out in the wild, so on Reddit, Twitter, Slack communities, uh, and also with uh, talking with Stefan, there's like a lot of you know, interesting background you can get from just seeing like, you know, what are the conversations happening just out there in the world related to MA10, to competitors, uh, to, you know, the general space of workflows and automation. So our, our solution was quite simple. We, we kind of scoped it down a little bit just to have like a, a V1, 0.1 that we could ship today. So we have a list of 23 competitors here that we've just added. Uh, these then feed into a workflow here uh, where we're just checking Reddit uh, to see what people are saying about those competitors, uh, filtering for the recent posts, and then adding them back into the air table right over here. <clears throat> so we've got about 35 uh, responses. Annoyingly, a lot of them are just, uh, just bots. Uh, these are from the past seven days. And what we're taking from Reddit is obviously who's posted, what's the title, uh, what's the text of the post, mostly for searching, uh, and a few things like, you know, when was it made, where's, where's it located, uh, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and then going on to, I guess, the interesting insights. One is just seeing, okay, what are the kind of issues people are having with nodes on other competitors? Uh, this view uh, gives us that. And two is just, you know, actually going back to this. So here we're just filtering based on uh, any title or, or text of the post containing node integration, API connector or module. Um, and that actually then feeds in to a, just to show some of the, the cool stuff that Airtable does. So we have a weekly digest email uh, that goes out just you know, recording the, the kind of mentions of competitor nodes in the past week. Um, and a similar thing happens with uh, any mentions of partner and embed there as well. So we have this potential uh, partner that we've, we found, maybe relevant, may not be. Uh, I guess one of the things we, the challenges we had was there was a lot of data out there. So, and we decided to kind of be a bit more aggressive on the filtering rather than having to, uh, the automated filtering rather than having to manually sift through like thousands of potential hits. Um, and yeah, that's, that's the main thing. Any, any questions? <clears throat> 